Hello everybody, welcome back to another video with Mr. Coder, and in this video I'm going to show you how to do secret box question E from Code Forces around 952 Division 4. So, Natarsis has a box B with side lengths X, Y, and Z, and it lies in the 3D coordinate plane extending from 0, 0, 0 to X, Y, Z. And Natarsis also has a secret box S. He wants to choose its dimens dimensions such that all side lengths are positive integers, and the volume of S is K. He can place S somewhere within B, such that S is parallel to all axes, and every corner of S lies on an integer coordinate. S is magical, so when placed at an integer location inside B, it will not fall to the ground. Among all possible ways to choose the dimensions of S, Determine the maximum number of distinct locations he can choose to place his secret box S inside B. The Tarsus does not rotate S once its side lengths are selected. So, yeah. And for, for like, co if you're ever coding it, note that K may not fit in a standard 32-bit integer data type because K is less than or equal to X times Y times Z, which is 2,000 times 2 which could be 2,000 times 2,000 times 2,000, which would be 8 times 10 to the 9th. And generally, you can't fit more than 2 times 10 to the 9th. They're around there for under standard integer. But I define integer as long, long, so I never have to worry about a 32-bit. I can always have a 64-bit. So yeah, if we look at this first example, it'll be uh, 3, 3, 3, 8. So it's... So it will just be a cube in this case of three by three by three. And you're looking for a, something with volume eight to be in there. And if you choose the if you choose the side lengths two, two, and two, then it has a volume of eight because it's two times two times two. And there are eight different ways to put S inside of B. So, because you can keep moving it around in different places. And then if we take a look at the next case where it's 3, 3, 3, 18, then there's only one, there's only two ways to put it in because three times, because you'll have to choose side lengths as 3, 3, 3, and 2. And 3, 3, and 2, then there's only two different places because there's only one possible variable because all the other two are stuck in the same place. So there's two different possibilities. And then for this one, five, one, one, and then the volume has to be one. You can just do one times one times one. And then, so basically how, how you do this problem is you can actually brute force it in a way. Like you can't, so, but you have to be smart on how you actually, on what you brute force. So in my code, what I did was, because it has to all multiply x times the s's x times y x y and z have to multiply to k, which means that to choose them they have to be factors of k. So I got all the factors of k here, and this is for to not have any duplicates the k over the perfect square special case, and then I got I have a maximum and I I have the maximum and then I go through uh a b and c for the whole factors and then i get those factors set them as x y and z cap capital and if x times y times z is not equal to k then you can't then you can't do that if x is greater than k or y is greater or if if capital x is greater than x or capital y is greater than y or capital z is greater than z then it, then it can't be inside b S can't be inside B, so it wouldn't work. Otherwise, you just get the maximum of the current maximum. And you do X minus capital X plus 1. So then it would be inclusive for all the possibilities. And do that same for Y. Y minus capital Y plus 1. Z minus capital Z plus 1. Multiply all those together. And that's the number of ways you have. And then you just print it out at the end. So yeah, that's... And if, if you check this, this is matching with the sample output. And it also got accepted. But a key thing to note is that like that this fit this, this is in the time complexity and it fits barely. And 
a key thing to note is that it'll get TLE to unlimited seated if you don't include this pragma to optimize the for loops to prevent repetition and it it improves it by a lot. And from one of the cases that it took near it took four seconds, it was able to get down to 0.14. So that that's how much it actually that's how much it actually optimizes it for the one second time limit. Four definitely won't work, but 0.14 would work. So yeah, that's how you solve secret box question E from Code Forces around 952 Division 4. So yeah, thank you for watching this video. If you like this video, please like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.